Today, as an introduction to the channel, I wanted to give a quick little tip and bubble on how to set the tab order on an input form. So the tab order is simply how a user can interact with the form and move from field to field to enter information. So as I select a field, if I um, hit tab on my keyboard, it should take me to the next field. The default behavior in bubble is that this tab order is uh, top to bottom and then left to right. So what that means is in, it will look at this first column of items and go top to bottom. Then it will look for a second column of items that are to the, to the right of these and will then go top to bottom on all those and so on and so forth. So the problem I have with this form is that if I use the default behavior and tab through my items, after city, I would prefer to enter a state, but instead I'm taken to main email address. So how can we fix this? Well, it's actually pretty easy in Bubble. So if we open up the editor, I've got my pop-up for my form shown here. And all I need to do is group the items in the order I would like for the, uh, the user to tab through those. So for instance, I'm going to select these first three items and I'm going to group these into their group. Next, I want the user to go from left to right for city, state, and postal code. So I'll select those three items and group those elements in a group. And last, I'll select these, um, these last three items and then also group those. Now, if I go back to my form, I should get the behave, uh, expected behavior um, of client name, address, address line two, city, then state, then postal code, and uh, the final three fields. Let's see if it works. So as I tab through, yep, perfect. You can see now that the tab order goes client name, address, address line two, city, then state, then postal code, then email address, phone number, fax number. Awesome. So again, a quick little um, tip on how to use groups to your advantage, especially when setting a tab order on the forms.